Hey everyone, it's Tiara from Shop Like Me. Today I'm putting on Tori Bell lashes onto my mom. She had gotten the Made in USA liner and it just did not work for her. So I switched it out with the classic liner. And so this is the first time we're using it. So I'm stirring it really good. So you see me stirring the wand, trying to make sure I get all the particles off the inside of the thing to make sure they stick. And I'm putting it on her. I'm not used to putting makeup on other people. So um, it probably took me a little longer than than it should or if you're doing yourself but uh pretty much you're putting on like liquid eyeliner and you're gonna do two coats of that so you'll see me do both eyes and then go back and do another coat as those are drying so for this video i am doing date night lashes and I thought they would look good on her because she has hooded eyes, but you, there was a lash there. And since this is the first time you're using the lash, you want to kind of like bend in between each one of the magnets. Just kind of bend it, flex it, um, and get it so it's just real flexible and not, not stiff. So you'll see me kind of like roll it and bend in between each lash, and then you'll see me kind of just roll it and kind of loosen it up. And now I'm about to do the second coat of eyeliner and you'll see me again stirring it because this is, since this is the first time I'm using it. Plus you just want to stir it good to make sure, you know, it magnetizes well. And you want to pull it out without wiping it on the inside of the thing. So with the second coat, I'm kind of going back and getting where I didn't get quite as good on the first coat, especially that inner corner of the eye. I know a lot of people have problems with that sticking. So just making sure you get that pretty well and if you have to go back on it again just to kind of even it out and get a little thicker then do that so I am gonna let the liner dry right now I'm just like checking to see the measurements and I think that we need to trim her lashes because they kind of pop up in the corners so what I'm gonna do is I just want to see how many I should take off and I'm showing her right here where the magnets are and how you trim them um, and so pretty much I'm just going to take off one magnet. So I just want to cut off one magnet and you want to start with the outer corner, the longest part of the lash. Now these lashes are tapered on both ends, so each end is the same. But you start on that outer corner and I'm going to show you here. And then you just take off one of the magnets up to the next magnet. Only do one magnet at a time. If you need to trim more, that's fine, but just do one at a time so you're not taking off too much. And there she was reminding me to bring it up to the camera, but I cut it off. And you want to go ahead and just save that piece that you cut off. You can use that as an anchor or as a filler or anything else that you'd like to use it for. So as you can see with me trimming them, they're like perfect length now before they would pop up on the sides because when your eye is opening um, and it's just, it's not positioned right, it's going to come up. So um, getting them cut correctly helps a lot and so the lash kind of starting like right uh, where the color of your eye is and then ending be right before the end of your eye because you don't want it to get into that crease or else it's gonna pop up so just making sure your lash is the right length and they are designed to be trimmed that is what they're made for but she was playing around she was really excited about it because she's had them for a while but never could get them to work and now she's really excited because she's like, oh my goodness, they're very magnetized and it felt totally different to her. So I was excited that she was finally able to get it, try it and she was excited about it and they looked really, really good on her. So now she's just showing you the lashes, closing her eyes, showing you the lashes and how it looks on hooded eyes. And they came out really nice and very natural looking. So thanks for watching. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate you.